In this video we're going to create a terrain model from an ASCII file and then we're going to append another text file to it. First we're going to create the terrain model from ASCII file dialog. You can create the new text import settings file or save this one. Once you set it up here we're going to select the file format We're going to do the columns. Here you can import from the first line to the end of the file. You can select the decimal separator. Is it a comma? When you go next to the columns, here's where you're going to select what the feature type you want to do want spots or breaks. The column delimiters is a comma. And here you can select the columns. You can leave that one to skip. Select the other one as your northing, your easting, and your elevation. You also have some options for filters. You can save this format to later on use it again. So it's a good idea to save it. And when you're ready, you can select the feature fi uh, definition, existing ground. Edge method, you can select to remove slivers or select a maximum triangle length. When you click import, it will process and you will see your terrain in 3D on your design file. If you want to append, you can just turn on, select the file, the ASCII file you want to add or append and click on the option to append to existing terrain. You can select the terrain model you want to append it to. Use the same wizard settings file, the same mesh method, and when you click import you will see the rest of the terrain added to the original. Thank you.